Hey guys, this is Kristen from the Kennedy Room of Local History and Genealogy, bringing you the next episode of Genealogy on the Go, where we cover genealogy tips and tricks in 15 minutes or less. Your books can be a great source for finding photographs for genealogical research, and honestly, they're just a lot of fun to look through. In this month's episode of Genealogy on the Go, we are going to quickly explore what your books the library has in its collection and other means of locating and accessing your books online. Let me go ahead and point out that the Spartanburg County Public Libraries does have a rather large collection of yearbooks for schools and colleges in this area. A lot of these are located in the Kennedy Room at the headquarters library, but many of our branches also hold yearbooks for the schools that are in their vicinity. Here's just a quick overview of some of the schools we have yearbooks for. So it should be noted that we don't always have a full run of a yearbook, so I would definitely recommend calling or checking our library catalog before you come. You can do this by going to spartanburglibraries.org and then in the search box just type in the name of the school you're looking for. So for this example, let's try Dorman High School. I'll type that in and then I'll hit go. And the first result we get is for Dorman High School's yearbook, Vanguard. We can click this link and then if we scroll down, it should show us what years are available and where they are located. So it looks like we have quite a few uh, yearbooks for this uh, school and they are located in the Kennedy Room at the headquarters library. Another way you can look for yearbooks is online. And when I say online, I'm not talking about the subscription or pay to access websites. Some schools have actually digitized their yearbook collection and placed it online. Dorman High School, Wofford College, and USC Upstate are some of the schools that I know of that have many of their yearbooks in online collections. And you can usually find these things by going to Google and typing something like Wofford College yearbooks in. Uh, but I will include the links for these collections in the description box below. The Spartanburg County Public Library also has yearbooks in their digital collection. To access them, visit our website, spartanburglibraries.org, and scroll down until you see Historical Digital Collections. Click there. Once you've accessed the collection, the easiest way to locate your books is by searching for them in the search box at the upper right hand corner of the screen. So in this example, I'm just going to search for your books and then click search. This will bring up all of the yearbooks available for viewing in our digital collection. Of particular interest is the Little General, which was the yearbook for the Spartanburg General Hospital School of Nursing. Another interesting collection we have is the, uh, the Tiger, which was the yearbook for Carver High School, with Carver High School being one of the first African-American high schools in the city of Spartanburg. Once you find the yearbook you want to look at, you can click on it and scroll through it page by page. Another good place to locate your books is on Ancestry.com. And I know when we think of Ancestry, we typically think of a subscription-based website, but the library has a subscription to Ancestry that patrons can use for free. To access this subscription, go to our website, SpartanburgLibraries.org, and once there, uh, go to Learning Tools. And then we're going to narrow down um, our search to genealogy in the filters on the left hand side of the screen. And this will limit our results to only genealogy databases. Now, typically you have to be in the library to access our Ancestry subscription, but due to the pandemic, Ancestry can currently be accessed at home as long as you have a library card. This access is currently available through March 2021, and we don't know what access will look like after that. So because I'm at the library filming this, I am going to choose the from the library option. Okay, so now that we're on Ancestry, I'm going to take you through a series of clicks to get you to the yearbooks the fastest way I know. So you'll go to search and you'll choose all categories. And once there, uh, scroll down and look at the right hand side of the screen until you find uh, school directories and church histories. 
From there, we'll choose School List in Yearbooks. And we're going to narrow this down even further by clicking on U.S. School Yearbooks. Okay, so now we can narrow it down by state, city, and the school name that we're looking for. So uh, we'll choose South Carolina, and then we will choose Spartanburg. Okay, so this brings up a list of schools that Ancestry has yearbooks for in Spartanburg. Um, let's try looking at the Spartanburg High School yearbooks. Okay, as you can see, Ancestry has quite the collection of yearbooks for Spartanburg High School. We'll just scroll through these real quick and then we'll choose one to look at. Okay, so once you've found the yearbook you want to look at, you can scroll through it page by page, or as you can see at the bottom of the screen, I am just choosing a page number to look at. Unfortunately, this one didn't have pictures on it, so let's try one more. Okay, and so here we have a picture of the girls' basketball teams for those years. If we'll go back, ideally this would take you back to the screen with the list of yearbooks, but it didn't quite work that way. But it'll be a good chance for you to look over um, how I got to the yearbooks one more time. Uh, Ancestry also has yearbooks for other areas in Spartanburg. Here we've looked at Packlet Mills and they have yearbooks from Mays High School, which was the African American school in that community. Uh, they also have yearbooks for Calpins. Uh, let's see what they have. Um, and so they have your books for Kaplan's High School. So these are just some of the ways you can access and locate local yearbooks. And the same techniques can be used to find yearbooks in other communities as well. In addition to your public libraries, online collections, and Ancestry.com, some other places you might have luck finding yearbooks include through individual school districts, local history and genealogical societies, academic libraries and archives, and even through local thrift stores and online sellers like eBay. So we hope this video will be of some help as you go about looking for uh, yearbooks. If you have questions about locating yearbooks or about any of the other local history and genealogy related materials in our collection, feel free to visit our, the Kennedy Rooms webpage for more information and for information about contacting us. Happy researching!